Every part of our body has a range of motion that performs a segment of a circle around the joint. In other words, there is no natural motion available that pulls the bow always in a straight line perpendicular to the string. We have to combine several motions of the upper arm, lower arm and hand with adjustments in the elbow and the wrist to keep the bow always parallel to the bridge. Playing from the middle to the tip requires straightening your elbow. In the middle, you can envision an imaginary square from your sounding point to your shoulder, shoulder to elbow, elbow to hand and hand to sounding point. When we arrive at the tip, this becomes a triangle between sounding point, shoulder, your arm and the bow. We go back to the square and now to the frog where we reach another triangle formed by the line from your sounding point to your shoulder and by your upper and lower arm. Please note that your bow grip should not change. Your wrist has to make the necessary adjustments at the frog and at the tip. Your upper arm always stays at the same level as your bow. On the G-string, the arm is higher and on the E-string it is close to your body. The up bow is always initiated by closing the elbow, not by lifting the arm.